friends, welcome back to Lakeisha Loves to Plan. Hi everybody, today is Passion Planner Monday on my channel. I am so happy to be doing my February monthly with you. Um, once a month I do sit down, look at my goals from the previous month. Uh, I also do the part in the Passion Planner that tells you to reflect on the previous month. And once I, I've done that, I'm ready to set goals for the next month. So I am so happy to share with you my goals for February. If you want to take out your planners and plan with me or just take out a sheet of paper and talk about your goals with me, that will be great. Um, so glad to see you today. I cannot believe it is February already, y'all. I mean, really? Springtime is on the horizon. And um, this is the first year I'm like, yes, spring, because I have been experienced so experiencing so much snow. If you live on the East Coast, you have been experiencing a lot of snow. Now, I love the snow, don't get me wrong, but too much of anything drives you nuts. So I cannot wait until I see some flowers or something. I'm not looking forward to the bugs. I mean, that's why I honestly, spring is not my favorite season because that's when the ants come out and all that stuff and I do not like bugs. But I am looking forward to the flowers and the trees and everything just coming out and looking so pretty. I am looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to Lent and I'm looking forward to Easter and all the fun that spring brings. But don't let me get ahead of myself. So I am going to be talking about February. February is the month of love and friendship. Um, I looked at like all of the uh, holidays in February and it is National Friendship Month. I was like, okay. And it's also National Heart Association Month. So just being mindful of heart disease and making sure like exercise is prevalent and um, strong in your life and things like that. So now that I have done all of that pre-work, looked I looked at last month and my goals. Um, last month I achieved most of my goals. I was so excited. Just a couple things I need to just transfer over. And um, now that I have looked at February and kind of like, you know, what all of the things that February is going to bring, I am ready to plan. So I am using this Dollar Tree uh, sticker book. And uh, when I saw this, I had right away thought about February. I bought this, this sticker book like a couple weeks ago, but I saved it for the monthly. I was like, this would be really cute. So that's why I'm using this here. I'm also going to be using an American Craft sticker book later on. And, um, some other stickers I think I have some leftover um, Aaron Condren stickers I'm gonna use for my date dot so I'm gonna be using those so I'm gonna let the music play a little bit while you see me decorate my planner and then when I come back I'm gonna share with you my February goals and in the comments I would love for you to share one or two of your February goals with me as well stick around Make it through the storm. Now, but trust me, yeah, trust me. 
goodness, I just love this doll from the Cuteness Boutique on Etsy. If you love planner dolls, there is a new shop called the Cuteness Boutique. My friend Trika from Trika Plans owns it and there are some fire dolls there. I am a PR person for her shop, so please use Lakeisha20. Go ahead on over to Etsy to the Cuteness Boutique, B-O-W-Tique, and receive any of these beautiful dolls. So I like her. She has her hat on because it's still cold outside and she has her cup of coffee um, which I drink every day so she just reminds me of me um, I'm now quickly going through some of my old plant um, happy planner books actually I'm gonna take this truck up because I want to use this space to write um, but this is my uh, glam I think it's called glam girl glam book so I'm just taking a couple stickers from here too um, and I am almost finished with completing this so let's go over my February goals so February my February goals are around um, all the areas of my life so including um, work uh, I have a lot of deliverables to finish for work this month so my goal is to complete all of those deliverables deliverables um, I'm also in the middle of trying to prepare my paper for to be final for my uh, dissertation so I can be ready for defense so I am going to be working diligently on my paper so work and my paper I kind of like my two main goals this month to work on and somewhat complete and then because it's national friendship month hey i want to spend some time with my friends <laughs> so oh this is my goals um tip in y'all so you know i have to do a tip in here so this came from um simply gilded so i'm gonna find somewhere to put this um and then um as what I was saying about the friendship is that I want to spend time with my friends especially my planner friends because we're going to go wild the first week of March so I'm going to be spending this month getting ready for the go wild conference I'm so so excited it's been postponed for two years and now we finally get to go I'm so excited and then I also want to um, also get prepared for the actual trip make sure I'm packed I do need new luggage um, figuring out my budget I want to save for the trip and all that good stuff um, as far as my home I want to focus on getting my fireplace fixed and get a quote for recess lighting in my living room and in my kitchen because I really want recess lighting in those two areas in my home and then as far as my health I definitely want to continue to meditate every day um, I need to change my exercise regimen um, I have to change it up because I get bored with my regimen so I don't know I'm thinking about joining the gym but I don't really like doing that either so I have to really think through like exercise like what I want to do there's so many things you can do y'all like swimming and running or joining taekwondo or yoga so I just need to figure out what I want to do and then um, spiritually I am creating gratitude journals using my Vin Von Alley monthly subscription so stick around because I'm gonna be setting up every month um, a booklet and it's going to be my gratitude slash meditation slash prayer journal so I'm so excited about that and then uh, Valentine's Day is coming up and this is an area of family I definitely want to um, make baskets for my kids I usually give my kids something for Valentine's Day just so they can know that mommy loves them very much but I am obsessed with making baskets now so I think I'm gonna try to make them some Valentine's Day baskets and give my girlfriend friends some galantine gifts <laughs> and then oh back to my health one thing I forgot is that I need to make my annual health appointments my pap smear my uh, breast exam and things like that so I need to do that because this is the time of year for me to do that and then the last thing I want to do this month is I want to read one new book I have um, a lot of books um, but I like to just stay up to date on current uh, life coaching topics so I'm going to choose a topic and I'm going to read a new book on it I'm thinking about either the topic of discipline or the topic of manifestation so uh, you know I don't really know which one I'm going to do but I'll figure it out so I am using these beautiful um, gold sticker dots this is my last one from Erin Conjin the pack 
I had this pack for like two years. The pack was so packed that it took me a while to use it all. And then my tip in, I'm going to put all the goals I shared with you on my tip in. Look at this, y'all. One last look of this gorgeous February monthly layout. Y'all, if y'all like this, please smash that like button and hit subscribe and hit the notification for more Passion Planner Mondays and videos like this. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. I hope you have a blessed February and I hope you enjoy planning in your planners and I'll see you next time. Bye, friends!